Hey you guys, it's Isabella. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today's video is going to be all about my Apple Watch. This is the Series 4 in rose gold 40 millimeter. I just wanted to share with you guys what I keep on my watch, what I use it for, and accessories that I'm planning on buying because I was going to wait and film this video when I had accessories, but I'm still trying to find ones that I want. So, um... I pretty much have an idea of what I'm going to order from Amazon basically for that. But if you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Isabella. Welcome. I really hope you stick around. Don't forget to click the subscribe button down below and turn on your post notifications. That way you're notified whenever I upload and you don't miss out. I upload every Friday and I basically post videos about college and lifestyle. Right now it's mainly lifestyle because school is out of session for me until a few weeks because I start summer classes. But... Basically, I just wanted to share what was on my watch with you guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump right in. Also, while you're at it, while you're subscribing, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram and my TikTok. They will be right here somewhere on the screen. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into this video. Okay, so I wanted to just tell you guys that I'm gonna be screen recording everything that's on my phone or everything that's on my watch on my but basically i'm going to have the screen recording right here for you guys so you guys can see so like i said um i have the apple watch series 4 in rose gold and i just have the pink sand band that came with it um yeah so right here we can see my screen recording um you can see the face of my watch it's the um the one that has like i don't know what it's called but it has like my stats and stuff on it so it says like the date that then i have messages um activity and then i have the breathe app. and then i have the breathe app so i mainly use it for health and fitness because i do work out three times a week of, um i mainly use it for that and that's what i mainly that's what i mainly got this watch for was just for like health and fitness and stuff and also it looks really cute but mainly it was just to tr keep track of how many calories I was burning and how many circles I was finishing. So that's basically why I got it. So I can show you my app layout. Um, I did go ahead and clear out like a lot of the apps that came um, pre-downloaded or like that got downloaded from me having them on my phone that I got downloaded here. So, uh, so if, I mean, they're a lot less than what I had. So let me just show you guys what I use. I mainly use, um, I sometimes use calendar, but like it mainly just reminds me when I'm about to go to an appointment or go to work and stuff like that that I'm heading there or that I have to head there. And then I have the workout app, which is basically what I use to track my fitness. Let me just go there really quick. So this is my health and fitness app. I've moved. 441 calories and my exercise was 57 minutes today um i took 2535 steps and a distance of one mile 1.2 miles climbed four flights of stairs and my workout okay so i don't even i haven't noticed if this has changed please let me know if there's an option for pilates on the on the watch app for working out because i log my workouts as yoga and I feel like mine are more intense than yoga actually is. That's just me because it's a mix of yoga and like Pilates and other things. So um, that's personally what I'm wondering. Um, I can probably check, but whenever I go to workout, I just, I get there, I sit, and then the workout starts right away. So uh, yeah, so I don't really have time to check, but if there is a Pilates option, I would really like to know. And so as you can see, um, this is the first of, I've been, April I was, okay, so during quarantine I wasn't going as much, I mean my studio closed because, um, you know, quarantine and, and the pandemic we're going through, so, but right here is just March, April, May, I started going back in May, well actually no, it was June, and you can definitely tell how many circles I've completed. So I've completed a lot, actually. Most of my progress, a lot of my workouts burn around the same amount of calories. Yeah, so I've been going, I've been working out for like almost a full year straight and I feel really great. I used to do dance in high school and stuff, but 
excuse me, there's a motorcycle outside. Um, but yeah, so I used to work out a lot during high school and I kind of have just gotten back into swing of things. I'm almost 23 so it's been a little bit, but I'm really happy that I started working out again because um, I feel really good. <laughs> and so, yeah, I mainly use that. I have gotten some awards and stuff on here. So that's just my, I should probably have not enabled that. Anyway, so that's basically what I use my watch for. Um, and I also can call from it. I mean, obviously we can all use our watch to call, but I have cellular and so that's probably why I can. I know most watches have like the option to add it to your phone line or not. Mine is added to mine. Before I switched to my own phone plan, I had it on my parents' account. They said it was fine and it's really not that much money. That's not much more to get it on your phone line. But yeah, so then I use also the breathing app and then I use um, messages and messenger. Um, those just to quickly respond to maybe some friends or some text messages that I have to respond to if I'm like in class and I left my phone in the classroom. Then I have my watch and I can just, you know, type away. Or like, you know, if I just don't have my phone with me, it's really convenient because I can answer calls with my watch and I can also respond to text messages. And you can play, I think, some games on here, but I don't have any games. So. I like the Daily Bible app because I believe that you can actually look up Bible verses. Let me see. Yeah, you can have a daily reading plan and stuff and you can set reminders and have notifications and stuff to like read your Bible every day, which is definitely something that I'm trying to get better at. Uh, and then the Weather Channel app, I believe, can just is just really informative about the weather and stuff. I mean, obviously, I use it a lot on my phone. Right now, this is 89 degrees outside. So that's basically what I use my watch for. And I will try to link some accessories that I've seen around YouTube in the description down below that I'm probably gonna get for my watch. And I will update you guys. And I will also probably post a picture of my new accessories on my watch on Instagram. So if you're not following me already, definitely go follow my Instagram. It is just at Isabella Velizmoro. It will be right here on the screen. And also, don't forget to follow me on TikTok. Both of them will be right here. And yeah, that is it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you liked it, please give this video a big thumbs up for me. And don't forget to subscribe for some cool like apps to have on my Apple Watch. So if you have any suggestions, leave them down below. I would love to hear what they are. And yeah, so that is it for this video. Like I said, I really hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. I promise.